Day 2 of diagnosing fictional characters with real diseases. Until I get sued. <clears throat> Today, we are looking at the biological price of being the strongest. Gojo Satoru. Everyone thinks the blindfold is a style choice, or that he eats sugar because he has a sweet tooth. Wrong. Those aren't quirks. Those are life support mechanisms. Gojo possesses these six eyes, which allow him to see cursed energy at an atomic level. But biologically, this means his brain has zero filter. A normal brain ignores 99% of what it sees. Dust, light shifts, background static. Gojo sees everything, every photon, every atom, all at once, forever. In neurology, this is a catastrophic failure of sensory gating. His optic nerves are flooding his cortex with millions of terabytes of data every second. This leads to excitotoxicity. His neurons are firing so fast they are literally burning themselves out from the metabolic heat. That is why he eats sweets. He's shoveling glucose into his system just to keep his brain from starving. But sugar isn't enough. To survive, he constantly uses reverse curse technique to destroy his own fried brain tissue and regrow it fresh. He's effectively lobotomizing himself every single second of every single day just to keep from having a stroke. The blindfold is the only way to dim the world enough to give his mind a break. He isn't a god. He's a patient living in a state of constant, agonizing sensory overload. Chronic sensory gating failure. That is my diagnosis. See you tomorrow. Stay sharp.